This is the Esky Arctic Pro 70. This icebox has stainless steel locking clips and hinges and it's also lockable. It's got a fully insulated lid and body with 2 inch thick PU foam. There's a silicon gasket to keep the cold in and a stainless steel stay to keep the lid open. It's capable of 7 days of ice retention depending on conditions and use. There's a two-piece drain bung to release some of the water or slurry, so if you wanted to do a quick release, you could use the larger bung. And if you've bought a couple of Arctic Pro coolers, you can stack them on top of each other for convenient transport and storage. The Esky Arctic Pro Rugged is one of the most innovative and high-spec coolers on the Australian market. Designed in Australia for Australian conditions, it boasts the same features as the Arctic Pro, but with the following additions. It has a fully removable high-density foam seat cushion which attaches on top of the lid. Underneath the cushion is the recess for the cutting board and the channels which make the unit stackable. There is a unique auto-on cooler light which lights up the contents of your Esky when the lid is open, just like your fridge at home. The unit also has impact-resistant rubber bumpers and feet to give it that rugged performance. Even the handles are upspecked with additional TPU rubber overmolds and stainless steel tie-down brackets that double as a handy bottle opener. The Arctic Pro accessory pack is fully compatible with the Rugged series, so you can customise your Esky with trays, dividers, cutting boards and refillable ice bricks. And if you're looking for something a little more compact in our Arctic Pro range, you can get our 25 litre beverage cooler with retractable handle. To help keep your Esky contents and ice cooler for longer, Keep the Esky out of direct sunlight and avoid excessive opening of the lid. Put cold food and drinks in, as warm food and drinks will melt your ice faster. And empty out some of the residual water from the melted ice throughout the day. If you really want to get the most out of your ice, then we recommend using block ice where you can and add some salt to the slurry once it starts to form. Before storing your Esky, make sure you wipe it out and dry it thoroughly. And remember, you can always use the Esky as a handy storage bin when it's not in use.